Hello, faith leaders, and welcome to Break Time. Today, Psalm 2, 4 says this. Listen to this. The one enthroned in heaven laughs. The Lord scoffs at them. You know, it's hard for me to even begin to imagine God laughing at the rulers who are trying to break his anointing. But it, imagine, if you will, uh, we can't even begin to imagine how God thinks. You know, because our, I mean, we get, we get, we, every time I know that God's speaking to me, it's so much more than what I've ever imagined. His imagination, the way that God, God does things is so much higher than we do. So to even begin to begin to ask the question, why is God laughing? I'm not even sure it's the question that I want to answer. As far as I want to, I want to say this, when God sees people plotting in vain, or when God sees people plotting against him, I, I, it's almost hysterical to think that they they assume that they have power over God, that God doesn't have, that God is not all powerful, that God is not almighty, that God is not the great I am. And so in, in that essence, I can see that how God would think that's hysterical to think that you or I would ever have more power than he would, no matter how many people we gain around us trying to force um, to break the anointing of what God is trying to do. There's nothing that's more greater than God. There's no one that is more powerful than God. I mean, he parts seas. He, he allows the sun to come up and he sets it. Those days are his. And not only is he all powerful, but he sees the end. So when he sees people plotting to destroy his anointing, he, he knows the end. He sees, he sees the eternal perspective. You know, when we see it, when we see people plotting in vain, I believe sometimes we become fearful because it's almost like, it's almost like we think they hold power, but there's no one that holds more power. That's more almighty that <laughs> that can't break through that than our Lord. So why would we not in times of when we think God is, or when we think people are trying to break the anointing of God and they do it all the time, almost, it's almost like we bow to that power thinking that it's, it's more there. It's almost more powerful than the Lord. We may not even be processing that, but think about that. You know, we have a president in place. There's presidents in other countries as well. We look at them as our source of power, but you know what we need to stop and think about? There is a greater power that's at play than any of our any of our leaders that are over us. So if they're plotting something in vain, remember that God sees that. Remember that God knows that. Resist, resist the urge to play with, thinking that because out of fear or intimidation or even manipulation, resist and stand with the Almighty. Stand with Him. You, my friend, have a blessed day.